Hey guys, the Gamer here bringing you a new video. This video is going to be talking about a really cool thing that I found on the internet, which I think you guys found, will find pretty cool too. This is a equalizer for your computer. Basically, it equalizes sound. Um, so you can basically change everything from um, the gains of whatever frequencies you want to. You can even type in your own frequency. A whole lot of cool things. So stick tuned to learn more. Alright guys, welcome for sticking around. So let's go ahead and take a look at this little user interface thing. So what is Equalizer APO? Um, uh, uh, in this case, the Peter Equalizer APO Configuration Extension, also known as Peace. Well, this is the UI for um, Equalizer APO. Uh, if you want to go ahead and download this, you just go on to Google, Google Equalizer APO. Uh, it'll take you to the SourceForge link by clicking on the first link here. Or if you're kind of lazy, you don't want to do that, I'll have link in the description below. Once you go to here, download it, install it. If you have any problems installing it, just let me know in the comments below and I'll go ahead and make a whole separate video showing you guys how to install it because it can be a little bit tricky as there's a lot of settings you can choose to uh, pick to choose from and I'll go ahead and let you know the best ones to choose. Um, another thing is after you get this installed, there's also the um, UI, the piece GUI for Equalizer APO. Um, this thing here is, again, tricky to install. Again, if you want me to show you how to install this along with the Equalizer APO, let me know in the comments below. I'll go ahead and definitely produce a video for you guys about that. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump right back to the equalizer here. So this is the equalizer um, UI for the whole thing. Essentially, what you want to do is you want to pick a default setting that sounds pretty good. A uh, good thing to do is because most microphones don't have live feedback. Plus, additional thing about this is unless you have it set so your headphones also are altered by the um, equalizer. It, you don't really hear by live feedback if you use a microphone with live feedback. So the next best thing you can do really is you just open up a program like Audacity here. And then you just go ahead and let's say, let's start recording something. Um, testing one, two, three, testing. Testing the quality of this microphone with the APO equalizer user interface thingamabob. Recording something. Um, testing one, two, three, testing. Testing the quality of this microphone with the APO equalizer user interface thingamabob so yeah that's basically all that there is to it like you can choose profiles um, there's some really cool things to do with this if you guys are familiar with equalizer you can even make sound effects with your voice like let's say if you want to do a little thing where you want to be talking on the radio there's already default for telephone which you can hear now I sound like I'm on the telephone or like t just general telephones they sound really crappy and this is by the way a blue yeti microphone this is pretty cool um, again, this won't make every microphone sound really good. However, it will make most microphones and for recording YouTube videos or voiceovers for anything just generally really, really nice and easy to do. Now, let me go ahead and show you. This is the default setting that I normally do use is I actually, you know, edited one of them. I edited um, a few of them actually, um, bass and boost, uh, bass and high boost, uh, preamp minus six when I do loud stuff, normal if I do it normally. Um, yeah, but there's a lot of cool things you can do with it. I like this one. Let me go ahead and turn off the equalizer real quick. And the cool thing about this is all live, so I have it off right now. So basically, this the microphone sounds right out of the box. Well, I you know 50% gain on the microphone, zero levels on the computer for me in this instance. But I'm gonna keep it off the rest of these videos. Um, this is gonna save me a whole bunch of time. Like most of the time I spend editing my videos is editing the sound quality of the microphone. Because a lot of the time, this microphone lacks bass, at least for my voice. My voice lacks bass. This microphone can actually have a lot of bass to it. You just have to, you know, use the equalizer to get everything just, just right. But yeah, I hope you guys like this video. If you like to give it a thumbs up. If you dislike it, give it a thumbs down. And if you really like these videos and you want to see more from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I will be starting to produce a lot more videos now. I've moved out. There's a whole bunch of things I want to tell you later. And I'll produce a news video or a corner post video. Just let you know what's all going to go down. How am I going to do things? Maybe I'll put together a schedule. More than likely not because life happens and life comes first before YouTube in this instance. However, I would like YouTube to become my main job. And you guys can do that by liking and sharing my videos. So go ahead and hit that like button. Hit the share button. Share it with your friends. If you think that this is really useful and you have a friend that's using YouTube and they have a microphone, let's say a Turtle Beach, you can use this at the Turtle Beach. And if you want me to show you how to you know, set up a Turtle Beach headset, using this application let me know in the comments below and i will definitely produce a video there for you anyways this has been the wargamer signing out hope you enjoyed it and again peace